the names though. Ronnie James Deer, he's a butler, and Vinnie Appersey. Yes. And they got, got it right. You got it your right. brother Carmen was out and I was going, yeah. a piece it, a piece it. And everyone was doing it. He said, like, can't anyone get this name right? So <laughs> we finally made it. Yeah. Giza, what's the problem, mate? Why does the uh, tour have well, to come to a broken end? finger, as you can see. Yeah. And um, I did it in Japan about two weeks ago. And I just carried on playing with it. And I've done, uh, you know, a lot of damage to it. And the doctor says I've got a, an emergency operation on it now. So how will you get around working tonight? You with this I'll one just use these two fingers. That's where I've been. I've had to use them in Japan and Sydney. All the way you've been playing with one broken yeah, finger. Yeah. There is a story behind it that, you, like when you heard it, you went to a Japanese doctor and he fixed it one way and apparently it was completely wrong. Yeah, he wrong. fixed it uh, so that it was bent it over that way, if you know what I mean. And now they've got to go in the other way. I know. Uh, <laughs> when I played the next night, the bones broke even more oh. and severed all the tendons in it. Oh, no. And I went to a specialist in Sydney. And he says, um, if, you know, if I don't get it done, I can go into hospital tomorrow for an emergency operation. Right. If I didn't go in tomorrow, I'd never be able to use that finger again. To so. the end of Korea? Yeah. So you'd better go in tomorrow. Oh, I yeah. am. That's in Brisbane <laughs> or in Sydney, mate? In yeah. Sydney, going, oh, back, to Sydney, going back to Sydney. Yeah. Yeah. It's a sad thing to hear, and we've got to uh, cancel some concerts. Will you tell us those, Ron? Sure. We're uh, cancelling, unfortunately, uh, Adelaide and Melbourne, which are... Uh, about four shows, one in Adelaide, three in Melbourne. Three in Melbourne, you've got to yeah. knock off, eh? And from, mm -hmm. you know, of course, what Geezer told you, the, the reason is yeah. obvious it's that quite it's legit. needs to be done so we can come back again next year. You well, will be back. Yes, we will. Oh, yeah, definitely. That way. Those people in Melbourne, uh, great apologies from the band. I know they really are, sorry. Could you, we'll just ask one question before we talk to you, Ronnie, about uh, past things. Your concerts, apparently, all bikies, bikies are quite strong in turning up to all the concerts. Is that still happening? Mainly in England, yeah. yeah. They tell me here in Brisbane there will be quite a few of them rolling well, I don't know, we haven't played here for years. No. <laughs> Did it happen in other states that you play? Uh, not so much, was it? Not so much in no, America. No. You get a lot in England, mate. Right? Might have quietened down a bit, eh? Mm. Here. Okay, can Ronnie, can we go back to Rainbow Days and, and when you left there and joined Sabbath? Is, is there a reason that you left? Did you have this job offered to you? We, we, you know, what was the reason? I left for my own personal reasons, really. Uh, I wasn't very, <clears throat> pardon me, singing tonight, of course. I wasn't, <laughs> wasn't very happy, really, uh, with the direction that the music was going in. Uh, yeah. We started the band with a concept in mind, and that concept got lost along the way. <clears throat> so I uh, decided to just hop off. That would be the best thing for me. And luckily, in the interim between leaving Rainbow and sorting out another career of sorts, uh, I was fortunate enough to meet uh, Terry and Tony. Yeah. And we got this together. It's good too. Oh, it's great. Yeah. What about the Graham Bonnet feel for Rainbow? Do you think that was a good selection? Well, I, I don't know. I don't know Graham personally. I think he's a very fine singer. I think he's certainly doing a good job. Uh, I don't think Graham is doing very much writing with the band. I was much more involved in, in the right. writing. Richie and I did most of the writing for the band. Uh, so in, in Graham's case, I don't know what his feelings are. Richie's probably happier because he makes more money from publishing. <laughs> And Vinny, you're the newest member. Yes. Okay. Yes. What bands did you come from? Very quickly, if you could. <coughs> I used to play with uh, Rick Derringer. Oh yeah. Derringer band, yeah. Then after that, uh, had my own band, a uh, three-piece band called Axis. And uh, that, uh, right after that, was Black Sabbath. The Apathy family is doing very well in the music business, aren't yeah. they? <laughs> Good luck to drums, you. Drums, drums, drums. Drums, 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 right. <laughs> Love the beat of the drums. Have a great night tonight.